to death. Yeah. This, oh. If this doesn't get you, yeah, you're, 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 you're a narcissist. Okay. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, you're a piece of shit. Holy fuck, this is killing <laughs> This is actually killing me. Right yeah, because it, when another dog is gone, they can't believe it. Oh no. Oh god, oh, oh, oh. see that? There it is, there it is, there it is. See? Oh, this is dying owner. Oh, man, hey, man. This is gonna turn into like a, uh, your mom's house where you just, where you watch this fucked up shit. No, 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 I can't oh, see this. Oh, god, god, stop turning it off, man! <laughs> I'm not man! They get worse and worse. You know what I mean? Yeah. The next one is like a dog wearing a wetsuit, <laughs> diving in to save six other dogs. Jesus yeah. Christ. Whoever put that together yeah, has no gate who has no gauge of how extremism works. <laughs> They're like, oh there's a dog crying on its um, on a, the old owner's grave. And then four dogs in the street that were bludgeoned by cars pawing at each other's face. It's just that was a little too much. Too much. Too much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Way too much. Yeah. Let me ask you this. Okay. Is there a movie that you cried on? Oh, I cried. Oh, I cried shit, a million I cry movies. movies all the time. All the time. Where, okay, give me. Two I, I, I'll, I'll give you one scene one, okay. that makes me cry every time. The last second of the movie that Oh, uh, what's at the end? Then? So John C. Riley is dating this girl. This girl was molested by her dad mm. in the movie, right? He talked to, like he was. I like, remember the movie. Yeah, talk to host or whatever. Yeah. And he's. You know, going, I want to be with you, and we're going to do all these things. And it's just a fucking camera shot on the girl's face. And she's lo Start. looking at him with tears in her eyes, right? And the last second, she looks in the camera, and she smiles. It's so fucking good. Oof. It makes me, it's like redemption. Oh, it's like feeling safe. I felt it when you said it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What makes you cry then, Doc? Do you have something in your mind? Gladiator? Motherfucker, and she's like holding him, and he's dying. And mm -hmm. she's like, "Go to him," and they show his family, and then his wife is like, her hand go across the thistle, right there, that hand across the thistle. That's it. Hmm. Motherfucking tears. I'm in that motherfucker bull boy. As the music, every time. The music. What did you just say, Fancy? As the music. The music. The music. Yeah. The music. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck. It's yeah. like God. Yeah. Yeah. What about you, Jules? What, what have you tried on? It's the dog movie, Hot Chico. Air Bud. <laughs> I do get it every time I see her butt. Yeah. I start Not air butt! Hot Chico? What? Hot Chico. Hot Chico? Yeah. P-H-I. It's an anime? It's in a fucking no, anime? No, it's not anime! <laughs> I've never heard of Hot Chico the movie in my entire fucking life. That's the movie. What is this? Who's in there? Wow. Richard fucking Gear? <laughs> <laughs> Richard Gear? Does he jam the fucking dog in his asshole? <laughs> Bring up the trailer. <laughs> that would make me cry too. <laughs> that would, oh, that hurts. Do you even know what he's at? What he's joking about? No. Yeah, it's oh, a, it's an urban legend. I don't think it's not true. <laughs> but there's always been this urban legend, and I don't know what I, I came know. from. Where Richard Gere stuck a gerbil in his asshole. What's a gerbil? It's like a little mouse. It's a little hamster. Why? I don't know why. What? What is that urban? Uh, how did that even come about? That urban legend. Oh. At the ER. The ER. What? The show? And he went to the emergency room and they had to get it out of him. That's really? Where the, that's where yeah. the rumor comes from. Oh wow. Hey, who knows? See, how much. but it's true though. Is it true? How could you? They're not gonna fucking. They'll have that removed. R highly questionable cultural history of Richard Gere's ass gerbil. <laughs> The article doesn't help me not know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's, it, it, it's called gerbling. Yeah. That's what it's called when you do when you put gerbils in your butthole. It, oh. ger gerbling. <laughs> gerbling. Yeah, and you gotta leave little pieces of food up there for it to find. Oh. It's animal cruelty, right? For some people. No, but the animal dies, right? There's no animal that goes in there. I bet it there. comes out alive. Really? Uh, if it, I mean, if I stuck you in an elephant's asshole, <laughs> for how long? For more than 15 seconds, you'd be dead. If I could get... <laughs> a little bit of air, I'd be okay. I mean, some people would say eating monitor lizards is bad. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. It's fine. It's normal. See, and so gerbiling might be normal in some cultures. Some people might be have been, gerbiling might have been the way that they found God. Uh, I don't want to question someone's religious. Yeah. You know. But is it, is the sensation? Let's just explore it a little bit. Um, is the sensation I would think is. To feel something die inside you? Ask oh Doc. My God. Well, fuck. You gerbled. No, gerbled, no, 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 no